Hello and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a video showing you my shopping habits for the month. I usually go to two stores along with Azure. Um, so I go to Costco and Whole Foods and I basically just buy what is cheapest there at each one. Now we have a gluten and dairy free diet because we have allergies. Um, so everything is not as cheap as, you know, just a regular diet. Um, but I do find some good deals. And this month I actually found really good deals on stuff that I normally get. Uh, so I'm just gonna take you through my shopping trip and I will show you everything that I got and all the deals that I got. And so we're gonna start with Whole Foods. At Whole Foods, you know, every, every month I usually get four whole chickens and it happened to be that they were on sale this month which is amazing, two forty nine. dollars it's like almost a dollar off. And so I get the four chickens and I also got some cheese. This diet cheese that we get was on sale, three fifty nine. dollars I get, I usually get four peppers. Orange variety of, of peppers was on sale for two ninety nine dollars a pound, which is amazing. So I got some of those. I think I got like eight of those because I like to make stuffed peppers once a month. I did get coconut. Um, we love to eat the um, chopped up coconut. Canyon bread was on sale. Now I I am trying to figure out how to make my own gluten free bread. That's really good, but the bread I make is not that good, and my kids have turned their nose up at it. So I'm still working on that. But uh, Canyon bread was on sale, and so I got like ten of those because I know that they can freeze and I know that we'll use them. Blueberries were $3.79. I usually pick up blueberries anyway. Um, I pick up one package of blueberries when I go shopping. But these were $3.79, so I picked up a package of those. Um, and at the register, um, my total came to $2.26.25, and that's adding on to my Azure um, of $7.49. So that's like, you know, a thousand and that's for the whole month plus whatever I spend at Costco. In my cart is the four chicken, the four whole chickens. Um, but I also did get, if you see it right there, four packages of the chicken thighs. So every month I usually get four whole chickens, four packages of big packages of the chicken thighs, and then um, four packages of chicken breast. And we'll have a variation of one of those, you know, uh, we'll have a whole chicken once a week, we'll have chicken thighs once a week, and then we'll have something with chicken breast once a week. Um, and I have a bunch of different recipes that I use to make that. And that, so that's part of our, um, our Whole Foods haul. Um, I didn't get to show you in the video, but Vans waffles are also on sale and I don't usually buy the Vans waffles because those are um, a little bit more expensive and I can make my own, but um, they were on sale for a good price. So um, I picked up a package of those because those are good for in the morning when I'm in a rush to get somewhere. That's Whole Foods. Now I want to go into my Costco haul. Oh. I also got these at Whole Foods. Now they were not on sale, but these are new from Good Pop. You know, um, you know, Good Pop has the popsicles. We get them all the time uh, when they're on sale. You can stock up on them. Um, at the end of the season, I think they go as low as eight dollars. Usually they're like twelve, um, but that's for the popsicles. But these uh, Good Pop chocolate, um, we haven't been able to have an ice cream sandwich for a long time because there hasn't been one that we have found that's gluten and dairy free. Um, but we did find these at Whole Foods and they are delicious. So here's our Costco haul coming up. We found these at Costco, the Simple Mills, and usually they are $8.99, I believe, but these were $6.99, so I picked up a package of these. These are delicious, they're so good. They're crunchy. They kind of taste like a, um, they kind of taste like a um, gingerbread cookie. Uh, these were also on sale and my children love these and we usually don't get them because they are way out of our budget usually. But 
I decided to splurge a little bit and they're down from $11.99 to $7.99. Um, whenever I go to, um, whenever I go to Costco, I also pick up some Rayos marinara, uh, especially if it's on sale, I'll pick up a bunch of them and they are on sale. Um, they are on sale. So I picked up a bunch of them because you know, they don't go bad. Um, if when they're $11.99 for this package, it is a little bit more expensive than just making my own with the tomatoes from Azure. Um, but when they're $8.49, it is really good. They're less expensive than making my own and it's a good time to pick up and stock up on them. And here they are in my cart. We love Rayo's Marinara. Also at Costco, we found something else that's cheaper at Costco than Azure. And that is parchment paper. If you look at Azure, uh, the price per 100 square feet is a little bit more expensive. So, and it's the same kind of parchment paper. It's only Kirkland just put their name on this, but it's the same culinary parchment paper. So we picked up a package of those and that will probably last me a month. Uh, Ziploc baggies. We actually try to reuse our Ziploc baggies um, to save money. Um, but these are on sale. And um, so we decided to purchase a bunch of them. And let's see what the sale price is. Ziploc slider and storage, and they were on sale for $3.80 off, which makes them $13.19, which is a great deal for Ziploc baggies. I believe we got one package of the gallon because I do put a lot of my um, stuff from Azure into Ziploc baggies. Uh, because we get it in bulk and then I can freeze it. So, you know, in the future, I'll maybe find a, a better way of storing our food, but that's what we do for now. And that's our Whole Foods and Costco haul, everybody. This will tide us over for a month. I have a bunch of recipes that I use and we just go through the same rotation depending on the season. Um, so for the summer season, I have a bunch of recipes that I use and I have a, a menu that I stick to and it helps us save a lot of money every month. Um, I also go once a week to get some eggs and some coconut, uh, so delicious coconut milk. And that probably adds like $20 a week onto our budget. So for our total budget for the month to feed a family of four, gluten and dairy free, all organic, um, I used to spend Sadly, embarrassingly enough, I used to spend 3000 a month. Um, but now with Azure, with uh, looking for deals at Costco and Whole Foods, um, I spend, let's see, 700 at Azure, 749 at Azure, uh, 250 at Whole Foods. It's like a thousand, about a thousand. And then I spent 200 at Costco. So like 1200 plus the additional money for, you know, eggs. So 1300 a month to feed us all organic and gluten dairy free. And that is an amazing deal. And if you want to see my monthly menu, uh, I can post that and uh, just let me know in the comments. And uh, I hope you have a great day or night, depending on where you're watching from. And uh, we will see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.